and welcome back to another video. So for today's vlog, my hater is on. I'm just investigating the construction right now. All right, well, it looks like it's definitely back on. Um, I thought they were done doing construction, but I guess they have resumed. They've resumed doing that, so lovely. Um, I need to clean my room. I'm gonna be filming a vlog today, but I'm gonna focus it on what I eat in a day. Kind of shindag, so it's lighting. <laughs> we love a lighting change. I'm going to just, yeah, show you guys what I eat, but vlog my day. So, hello. It is Tuesday. I'm about to wash my face. I ate breakfast. I showed you guys what I ate. Just some oatmeal, some coffee, and then I'm gonna go grocery shopping. My weekly, my weekly shop where I go and get what I need for the week. guys i feel like this is exactly how i would describe quarantine is changing from one gray sweater into a different gray sweater <laughs> but yeah this is my uh really exciting cute ootd i have some black leggings on from airy and then this sweater which is like three years old from zara that says los angeles on it and i did do my makeup i'm sorry if you can hear construction they're literally doing like road paving out in front of my house so yeah, I did put some makeup on. I'm just wearing the Laneige BB cushion. I love that just for like every day. It's super light coverage and like just really like it feels like you're wearing nothing. And it also has SPF 50, which is good because I'm trying to get as much SPF as possible. And then I'm just using all um, nude sticks like cream, bronzer, and blush. And then some concealer, chapstick obviously because my lips are so chapped now that I'm up a dosage of Accutane. And then just my normal eyeshadow that I always do in mascara. I'm using actually the Charlotte Tilbury Full Fat Lashes Mascara. I like it, I like it. Can you guys, okay, I'm sorry, this construction is so loud. Like, can you not? Can you not? Oh, they're literally coming up the road. What are they doing? I'm so curious. <laughs> I don't know what they're doing, like digging up the road or some shit. Um, what was I gonna say? Can you guys leave cop? Ugh. If any of you guys have ever used a lash growth serum, can you leave it down below which one is the best? Because I'm thinking of starting to use one. I really want to get my lashes like popping and I want to try one out, you know? I've never tried one before. And yeah, I'm sorry, this construction is so loud. I'm going to go to the grocery store now and just let's go to the grocery store and uh, survive that one, okay? made it to the grocery store it is time to uh brave the store who knew that grocery shopping would be like a stressful thing <laughs> not me not me that's for sure anyways and i go I'm gonna try to not breathe that much and uh not touch my face i got some hand sanitizer all packed and loaded and i'm i'm ready i'm ready to to face the grocery store so many people wear masks in there. I have a mask actually. My mom gave it to me. I should probably wear it, but literally everyone's wearing one. Maybe I will wear one. A vibe. A vibe. This is a good look. Okay, all done. Yay. wearing this thing huh <sighs> oh, I can breathe okay I think I was clenching my jaw in there okay all done time to head back home now I'm gonna make a green smoothie or something something healthy because honestly the groceries I bought I'm not gonna say they were the healthiest um things I don't you know healthy diet has kind of gone out the window in quarantine and I may come out of it like 10 to 20 pounds heavier, but that's okay. <laughs> hey guys, I'm sorry if you can hear construction. Can't, I can't stop it. I'm sure if I went out there and I said stop, they would just give me the finger and carry on with their day. So anyways, I thought I'd show you what groceries I got. Bear in mind, this is not the healthiest grocery haul you've probably seen on my channel. Definitely not. Um, hmm. First up, a pizza. <laughs> this is my favorite. 
I love the Ristorante ones because they're thin crust and I feel like if you're gonna get a pizza, thin crust is the way to go. I like this one, it's the pizza pepperoni pesto. Delicious, okay, so good. I got two, well, I got blackberries and I got blueberries, two packs of each. I got some fishy crackers because I'm, I'm suddenly addicted to them. I've been eating them so much, it's actually like insane. I don't know why I like the three cheese one the best. <laughs> I got some sour cream because I'm making fajitas for dinner tonight. I got some cream cheese. Clearly you guys can tell I'm not dairy free anymore. I went dairy free for my skin and honestly I was dairy free for like a year and I consistently got cystic acne that entire time and I love cheese so yeah. I'm eating cheese again because I don't care. And also, I haven't been getting any cystic acne, knock on wood, since I've been on Accutane and whatnot, and I've been eating cheese. I also got some <laughs> Annie's for, this is organic, for cheese, macaroni and cheese. Am I craving cheese or am I craving cheese? That is the question of the day. Oh, look. More cheese! Wow, I got some Tex-Mex cheese for my fajitas. Next bag. Hopefully there's not more cheese in this bag because this is embarrassing. I got some bagels for my cream cheese. I got three bell peppers for my fajitas. <laughs> fajitas, I don't actually think they're called fajitas. I just think it's funny to say it like that. I'm so quirky. <laughs> um, then I got some French fries. <laughs> Woo! The health is just through the roof right now. I got some pears. I wanted apples, but they didn't have any, so we had to settle for what we could get out here. Oh my god, I keep pressing the dishwasher. No, I don't want to turn you on right now. No. I got some of this, this is really good. This is by the brand Yellow Fruit. And it's like a non-dairy, not that it really matters if I was dairy or not, but I actually don't really like ice. I'm not a big ice cream person unless it's like a sorbet kind of thing. I really like this one. It's just, it's like a banana base ice cream kind of thing. This one's the mango one. I tried the strawberry one last time and it was delicious. So I thought I would try the mango flavor in it. Then I got some more toothpaste, Colgate Optic White, trying to get those white ass teeth going. I got some more cheese, Parmigiano for my spaghetti. Oh, oh, I got some more cheese products. Holy, this is, should I just call this a cheese haul? It's a cheese haul. Oh, oh. When quarantine is over, I will come back into my healthiness, but while I'm doing with quarantine, I need something to make me happy, and it's cheese, okay? Cheese is what's getting me through quarantine. <laughs> then I just got some spaghetti sauce, because they're literally always out at the grocery store since the pandemic happened. Apparently everyone decided that their main meal is gonna be spaghetti, so the sauce is always gone. So I got some, because I had some, this is my favorite. Just the roasted garlic one. Always an MVP. Then, of course, I got my little Vegeta box. <laughs> I'm just gonna use, I'm not using like the fajita sauce, but I'm gonna use the fajita seasoning mix just because it's easier and I don't have to buy in all the individual seasonings. And I'm gonna use the soft tortillas. There's 12 in here, which is a lot. It's a lot of tortillas. So, yeah. Vegetas. Anyways, I'm gonna put this all away now and wash my hands again. Okay guys, I'm gonna make a green tropical smoothie. So I'm gonna put mangoes, pineapple, and kale in it. And then for my supplements, I think I'm just gonna put like a scoop of the vanilla lean protein from Tropica. And I'm gonna put some of the super greens and vitamin D from Tropica. So this is like a bunch of alkaline greens like chlorella and wheatgrass, alfalfa, spirulina, all of that jazz. So we're gonna put some of this in it as well and have ourselves a little health smoothie after I just showed you all the cheese that I bought. I thought, you know, 
Let's just spice it up with a little bit of health, you know? Balance is key. Eat your cheese, but also eat your greens. I'm gonna patent that, and yeah. <laughs> I have all of the little, you know, all the jazz happening in here. I'm gonna add a bit of orange juice, and then I'm gonna put the rest with water for the liquid. I feel like the orange juice will just make it taste a bit better. This is 100% pure orange juice. I take it with my iron pills that I take. So just like that much, and then we're gonna add the rest as water, and this should be a tropical green deliciousness. Okay, and here we have it, the perfect green smoothie. This is like the best green smoothie color, you know? It's like a bright green. It smells good. Consistency is the perfect amount of thickness. I think I nailed it. So yeah, green smoothie, I'm going to inhale this and do some emails right now before I eat lunch. Okay, so I just put some laundry in and I'm gonna make some lunch now. It is 2 p.m. I usually eat lunch around this time. I don't know what I wanna eat. Ugh. I think I'm gonna make a sandwich just cause like, I don't know what else to eat. Maybe some soup too, I'm kind of cold. The house is cold, I could turn the heat up, but like whatever. I have like a heater in my room that I <laughs> blast all day long because I'm like this weird person. Like during the day, I'm freezing and I want my room to literally be like 27 degrees. I know that sounds insane. But at night when I'm sleeping, I want my room to literally be like 19 degrees, 20. <laughs> when I sleep, I want to be like my room is cold and I'm cozy under my blanket. Anyways, I just got completely sidetracked from what I was doing. But I need to find a soup. Look at my pantry. It's overflowing. It went from like being empty to being stocked in. I'm not gonna make one of those crap dinners, though it would be good. I'm gonna make this soup and a sandwich. Okay, let's get the sandwich ingredients out. We need some bread. I like this like organic spreaded power bread stuff. It's pretty good. So we need some of that. We'll need some cold cuts. Yum. We've got some ham and some chicken here. We will need some lettuce. I should have bought some like Swiss cheese or something, but whatever. Um, some baby romaine lettuce, love that. We need the mayonnaise. Um, I tried to get vegan mayonnaise. It's disgusting. <laughs> and I like mustard on my sandwiches as well. So I think that's everything. I don't think I'm gonna put any cheese on it. This will be good for now. It's about 4 p.m. now. I'm kind of craving a coffee, but I'm gonna have a tea instead because sometimes the coffee, like I crave it because I'm addicted to caffeine, but then I don't feel good afterwards. So I'm not gonna have that. <laughs> We're gonna push through our addiction and just have a decaf tea. Or should I have a caffeine tea? Maybe we'll have a caffeinated tea. I have this Yorkshire gold tea. It's quite good. Some caffeine, but not as, uh, doesn't make my head hurt as much as coffee does. Two coffees a day sometimes is too many for me. So I'm gonna have a tea and a banana. Finish watching more Love Island before I make my vaginas for dinner. So excited. <laughs> my trusted Taurus mug, always. Anything to do with being a Taurus, I am here, proud of, and I am representing because Hashtag best sign. Don't come for me. I'm sure people will because everybody thinks they are the best sign. <laughs> but, you know, you got you got to support your home team. So I'm going to put this down now so I can finish watching Love Island. Ugh. Oh, I need to clean that. We have a ring. It's around 6 p.m. now and I'm going to start cooking my dinner. I'm so excited to have fajitas. So I already preheated the oven. I'm gonna do it on a sheet pan. I feel like this is really easy to do it this way. So that's the way I'm gonna do it. So first off, we're gonna get out our sheet pan. 
I'm just gonna cut up all this stuff, lay it on the pan, season it, and then I'm going to cook that in the oven for like 20 minutes-ish. And then we'll garnish them and enjoy like some fajitas tonight. I'm excited. This should also be good because I'm like meal prepping. I'll be able to eat this tomorrow as well. So, yay. Okay, so the chicken is all out of the oven and cooked. I heated up two tortillas and now I'm going to actually like put together my thingy my bod things. So I have some cre cream cheese, sour cream, lettuce, some Frank's red hot sauce, and some cheese to put on it because I did not have any salsa. I thought I did, but I don't. So I'm going to make the best of what I have. <laughs> I'm so bad at accents. Anyways, I'm going to make these now. Yummy, I'm sorry for this like really shitty lighting. I don't know why the lighting does this on my camera. Two fajitas here, delicioso. I'm so excited to eat these. Hopefully they're good. I'm excited, yum. Dinner for me, fajita party for one right here. <laughs> Still not in focus, oh now we are. Ooh, I'm shiny as hell. I just finished eating and now I'm just packing a bag. I'm going to sleep at my parents tonight just because I haven't had any, haven't had any, <clears throat> oh my God, it's snowing. <coughs> it wouldn't be in April in Canada if it didn't bloody snow. Love that. But yeah, I'm just packing up a bag to bring to their house. I'm gonna stay there like tomorrow. I'm just gonna put y'all down here. <laughs> I'm gonna sleep there tonight and then probably like stay for the day um, tomorrow and just like hang out and stuff. Sorry, just getting my book. I want to do some reading tomorrow, hopefully. I think I have everything. I could just put these cords in here. That probably would have made more sense. Get me and my 8,000 cords I bring with me everywhere. And I think I have everything. I just need to try and shove a pillow in here. Can I do it? We shall find out. <laughs> I literally shove my freaking pillow into my suitcase and I make it fit. And I hope that I have everything. I think so. Skincare, makeup bag, laptop, chargers. Okay, wow, I did it. I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Impressive if I say so myself. A lot of people in my last video were asking if where my roommate is, if I still have a roommate. I do still have a roommate, but we're not always like home at the same time and all that jazz. So yeah, she's not home that much. And that's why y'all don't see her in my videos. And also I don't want to just shove a camera in her face whenever she's home. <laughs> so yeah, but anyways, I'm going to bring this. Ugh. And then I'll see y'all in my parents' house. I'm gonna take off my makeup and do a sheet mask there because I feel like pampering myself a wee bit. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Who's your baby? Hi. Good girl. A bunch of really sweet packages from some PR teams. So this one was really cute. They included some Nature's Bounty hair, skin, and nails um, supplements which I've tried before, I really liked them. Some Maui Moisture little travel size um, shampoo and conditioner, which I am so pumped about. These are perfect for just like going back and forth places, so love that. And they included a little pink scrunchie, a little comb, and these, um, it's by the brand South. They are fresh wipes. I don't know if these, what area these are for, <laughs> but that's really cool. And then next up I got this little package with some Shiseido, Shiseido, I hope I'm saying that right, products, um, a Laura Mercier rose oil, some hand creams from Burt's Bees, which I definitely need and I'm starting to dry out. I'll probably need high hand cream soon. And a comfortable renewing biocellulose gel sheet mask, which I'm excited about. 
And then I also got some protein bars by this brand. It's called Mezcla. Apparently it's launching in 2020, June. So I'm excited to try these. This one is in the Japanese matcha vanilla crunch flavor. There's a Mexican chipotle hot chocolate flavor and a Peruvian cacao peanut butter flavor. So that's really exciting. I love the packaging of these. It's really cool. And yeah, I'm excited. These are vegan, um, non-GMO, gluten-free, soy-free, and dairy-free protein bars. So it's 100% plant protein. So yeah, thank you to everybody who sent me these products. I'm so excited. They're so pretty. I just applied this face mask. So this is the Sulawasu First Care Activating Mask. Really good. These, you can buy these on Sephora online. I learned about this brand when I went to South Korea. And yeah, looking absolutely terrifying. I'm gonna leave this on for like 10 to 15 minutes and just watch TV. <laughs>